This is Al Jazeera. This is a news hour on Al Jazeera. I'm Fuli Batibo, live from our headquarters here in Doha, coming up in the next 60 minutes. Heavy gunfire near the presidential palace in Guinea's capital, Conakry. Several presidential guards are reportedly injured. The whereabouts of the president are unknown. Renewed fighting in Afghanistan's Panjir Valley overshadows the Taliban's efforts to form a new government. The resistance forces oppose its rule. Also this hour, protests and roadblock failed to stop the inauguration of a new head bishop for the Serbian Orthodox Church in Montenegro. I'm Pavni Mittal here in Muzaffar Nagar in northern India, where hundreds of thousands of farmers are protesting. And in sport, world number one Ashley Barty is out of the final Grand Slam of the season. The Australian has been beaten in round three of the US Open by home player Shelby Rogers. Thank you very much for joining us. We begin with breaking news from Guinea in West Africa, where heavy gunfire has erupted near the presidential palace in the capital, Conakry.